me buy my insure them by the cases. And a long time me I drink insure. I mean I make nobody stop me from drink it. Three insure me have left out of the case. Me not make nobody stop me from drink my insure. Why should I make people stop me from drink it? I see them so what do you make care of my insure go work and back it out? I make your one all the man say, Oh me not nah, drink that, that is your business. Me not nah, make no song, no music, no goggling, no sucking, no biting, no chewing, stop me from drink my insure. Me know when me a drink it fat. Me not throw it for nothing and suck it off. Me sure of that. Me a old school. Me not do them something there. I see him here, so you know. Me a watch one video with one girl one day. One big fat girl. Me don't know she favor. I go come talk about her every woman suck out and every woman gaggle balls. I see him here. Kendall Macri did say every woman get manly. Let me tell you something. Man, every woman suck out. And it's not every woman gaggle balls. And it's not every man suck and every man like them somebody. And then every woman I got entertain man where I do them thing they need that. And then every woman I got entertain certain type of things in them bedroom. And then everybody want to do them something there, you know. And then everybody a follow. Your favor one thing up. Your favor one thing up. Kendall bully beef, one a bully beef and one a mackerel. Come on, no one always a categorize people and I bring people in a things where uno want do anything where people want to do them free for do. Yeah, ensure three left. I'm gonna buy one more case as the one you don't come and I'll stop drinking. <laughs> now, you talk about the negative comments you mentioned there, people. You know, falsely, of course, you know, they were trying to say that you were somebody else. You know what I mean? And like you say, trying to say that you're a transgender. What do you say to those people? Um, actually, I just want to say, me slipping my number in his pocket was a slight chance of him actually calling me. But because of the negative comments, it actually caused him to reach out to me and say, Hey, don't mind the people talks. I know you was a female. Viewers and subscribers, Alkali and song when name static. People, all them said a song they're not bad. My favorite part of the song when Alkali and song. Any one of them is an ayale. I'm going to stick on the top of your straight. No one is static. Tell them forget it. You're best if you don't stop it. Part of the song that grind me. Massacre, you make this fly over your head and answer a song with General. You need to come reply. You hear me? This is it. If I review, make sure you say you well is smally than him review them accurate when everybody rang. You are watching them and you don't know say high voltage they represent for Malidan TV and Orange and Kiwi. Viewers and subscribers, welcome to Malidan TV. You don't know you're in tune to the Tarcha channel. With the Tarcha guy, you know I'm all in a folly. Watching them on a Sunday, no, please may ask you. Don't make me have a send for your Charlie. Yeah, hear me? The review god, I'm running out with another bad one, another touchy one. We have some things to talk in this video, you know what I mean? So big up to all of the people I'm from all walks of life where I support Malidan TV. If it's your first time coming across my videos in the media, please I'm asking you to hit that subscribe button, turn on the post notification bell, drop some likes on the videos, people. Also share the videos. Also use up the comment section and let me know what you guys think about this entire video that Malidan about to bring to the media. You get what I mean? I say, big up to the people, I'm on a beautiful day, like today, it's Sunday, and it's not a normal. Sunday. I just want to take the time out right now to big up to all of the real, big up all the real fathers out there. The man them were really stand up for their kids in whatever needs and wants. You're not only there on Christmas and birthdays and special holidays, but you're always in your kids' life and you don't leave your kids to struggle with their mom only. You're there to play your part. I salute you right now. Salute before my shoot. Big up to the real fathers, them right now in you know, the media, especially the beauty, them, the thugs, them. We are support Mali than the elder, them. I salute you guys, especially the ones who are doing the real okay. thing with their kids out there. Kudos to you. Keep on being that great dad that you are because I know the fathers don't really get much respect out here in the media and in life, period, worldwide. A lot of people, the period talk kind of funny still in the way. You hear me? Take out that. That not in it. Big up to the real fathers, them worldwide. We do the real thing. You know, big up to the real mothers, them. But you don't know it's not mothers there. The fathers, them need more respect. And you guys out there should show more love to the fathers, especially the real ones. The deadbeat ones, them on the candles. <laughs> Bury them because they're already deadbeat. Oh, yeah, you know the style already. But yeah, yeah, my people, coming up in this video, I'll be talking about alkaline and also dextodaps. And the reason why I'm going to talk about dextodaps in this video is because 
the female or the East Share, whatever they want to call this person that was dancing with Dexter Dubs, she did an interview in the Bahamas about Dexter Dubs and she had a lot of things to say about this entire situation in the media, seeing? And with me watching the interview that she did, and I'm about to bring it to you guys, I'm going to put it in this video right after I finish talking. When I was watching that interview, people, to me, it seems like it's a female, seeing? But I'm going to leave that to you guys to use the comment section and let me know what you guys think about this female, the one that they said it's a transi and it's a jag queen. She's here to clear the air right now. And Molly Dan is just going to slide in that interview into this video, you know what I mean? But before I get to that, let me just talk about the vendor tabas, alkaline. You don't know the one where them free the end of the media, where the youth were living at the swamp I run from. Yeah, people, you don't know. When you hear me sing static in at the beginning and the start of the video, it's because static is a really vibes this song and it's a going with a bag of things so far in the media. It's a playing at the street. Eh, I'm not up on the ground at Jamaica, but yeah, man, the dog, they must have all it on the arm to your artist thing right now. I hit a run off my beer and I want to some money. Some boy now no static Mali. The boy them a chop all now, them leave never mash it much as grass and them a chop from when. I mean, I say, eh, but yeah, yeah, my viewers and subscribers, I'm here to tell you guys that Alkaline song static hit a mill within seven days. Not the audio, but I'm talking about the video that Alkaline just released. It hit a million streams on YouTube and it's a good look, you know what I mean? That means people are gravitating to the song, people like the song. The song is doing well out there in the media, so big up to the Delta fans them. But always I keep the torch blazing. And you know, Delta we are the better we you don't know a gully vendor and our world and our media. No matter what they want to say, you get to me answer people, but you don't know. Big up to the people and we support the movement. You don't know Mali Dan, you know, you know Mali now Fali. So you hear me, people. I'm gonna excuse myself from this video right now. I'm gonna just put in this interview with this female that was dancing with um Dexter Dabs in the Bahamas last weekend, and it was ripping up the media that it's a man. So now she's here to clear the hair. But before I check out, please, I'm asking you to do so. Hit the subscribe button. Turn on the post notification bell. Leave some likes on the video. Also, my people, don't be afraid to share the video. You know I'm all in a folly, you know. You yeah, hear me? I touch her. <laughs> Yo, watch her style. Top Tell one. me, you know, Dexter Dabs came to town. He's supposed to come to town from... February, from my birthday, actually. Let me make it known. That was supposed to be my birthday gift. So... I went with intentions on doing exactly what I was supposed to do. Um, I must say, I don't regret it. And I had the time of my life being with the famous Dexter Ops, But to each its own, thank you all for the nice comments, the whole transgender thing. But I am a female and I had fun. <laughs> Tell me, you know, let's take us to the concert. You're there. How'd you get up on stage? Okay, so... From the early part of the concert, they asked who had intentions on going on the stage. At that point, I was the only female in the crowd to raise my hand and say, huh, I'm going on stage with him. And so everyone there kind of knew I had intentions on going on stage. Um, now, as the concert started, we got closer to the stage. And as the exit come on, everyone started pushing the railings closer. We was right to the stage. And, like, it was a particular song I was waiting on, but he didn't sing it. But I was like, okay. It looked like it ended. Now. I think it was the time I get up on the stage because I done IB had bought VIP tickets, but VIP was in the back with General. We said, We ain't come here to pay to be in the back there. We need to touch that stuff. So from there, we just gone and we changed over our tickets and bought in platinum in front of the stage. And man, I mean, as soon as I gone to go up on the stage, it was this officer. He tried to stop me and he's like, No, no, you can't come on the stage. You can't come on the stage. I was like, Oh my gosh, this guy just hurt my feelings in front of everybody. So I was kind of like hurting the way. I was like, oh my gosh, so how I get on the stage? So I stand there on the side and he's like, oh, you got to come down. You got to come down. So I was like, okay. So I politely bend down and then Dexter kind of got my, his eyes and my eyes kind of. So he's like, come on stage. And from there, I just run on stage and do what I had to do. My, my, my biggest intentions was to actually just slip my number in his pocket and come right back off the stage but after telling him that i actually put my number in his pocket i guess it kind of started sometimes but he didn't think i'm but 
other than that, it, it, we were just having fun, to be honest. We were just having fun. Everyone, if you watch videos from this previous concert, there's something that always happened. They're saying nothing that just come about, you see what I'm saying? So for me, I, I the, the negative comments, they actually don't don't bother me. They're not getting to me. If anything, y'all kind of push me to a place where I always wanted to be. I am. I, I love the dance. I love music. I love dance hall music. So... With that being said, even just getting the experience of taking trips, if I could, with him, I love it. I would love it. So, so you came off, you know, the concert ends, the next day the videos emerge. What's your reaction when you see that the video is kind of like all over the place? I, 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 at first, the Saturday was quiet for me. Saturday was quiet, like my phone wasn't blowing up. I guess a lot of people didn't even notice it was me at first until certain people so they started making it knowing that hey there's so and so but other than that saturday my phone was quiet but sunday boy my phone was blow from sunday my phone had been blowing up blowing up blowing up blowing up but nonetheless i enjoy the moment it's a moment for life i must say it, it is a moment it's nothing like when you dream about something actually happening and it actually happens fantastic now you talk about the negative comments you mentioned there people you know falsely mm -hmm. of course you know they were trying to say that you were somebody else you know what i mean and like you say trying to say that you're a transgender what do you say to those people um actually i just want to say me slipping my number in his pocket was a slight chance of him actually calling me but because of the negative comments it actually caused him to reach out to me and say hey don't mind the people talks i know you was a female and this is how we can do it so from there he offered me a, a ticket to go with him to brooklyn new york for his next concert on august 20th so like i say for the people who try to bring me down y'all actually bring me straight up to the top where i wanted to be so i just want to say thanks for the negative comments because sometimes it turns out for the better and I am very happy. Y'all don't know what y'all just started, but I am very happy. Tell me a little <laughs> bit more just about yourself. What do you do for a living? What, you, what else do you like to do for fun? Well, me personally, I'm not a drinker, but if I go out and music side to play, everyone who ever saw me over tell you, I just gotta hear music. I just love to bounce. I like to sing. I like to listen to music. So me personally, I'm just a cool person. Okay, so when, when it's time to hang out, I know, I, I know how to lie have friends who calm, who don't deal with that type of music, and I have friends who deal with that type of music, but to me, I don't judge people, and I don't expect people to judge me, and I live my own life. I don't live life because this one listen to that music, I love it. I dance, I love entertainment, I know how to act. Growing up, they always used to call me the little actor, but more, I'm more talented, okay? Whatever I put my mind to, I can do it. I used to run track um, back then in school, high school, and I've been to Carifta about two times. So, like, life is just, is it all in stages. You have your ups and you have your downs. I have been down for three years, and nobody, I could go about my story, but nobody knows. I've been down for three years, so what you all see that night, that's only a start of me living my life again. And just so, so that, that we know about a little bit your fun side, the more professional side as well. What do you yes, do for a living? Well, me, I'm a cashier. I won't say exactly where, but I am a cashier at uh, one of the number houses. Um, other than that, I haven't been working for three years. It's been difficult getting a job in the Bahamas for the three years. So I have just been at home and my mom was taking care of me, helping me during the pandemic. And that's the only assistance I had was my mom. So other than that, it's only her comments that actually matters. And to let everyone know, she feels no way about it. No way. Because as she see it, she see it as her daughter finally living life. Other than being at home, stressed out, crying, depressed, worrying. So thank you all. But just to let everyone know, I am happy. <laughs> Fantastic. Now, I got to ask this one. I, I, I think this is a good question. Do you have a boyfriend? No, sir, I am single. Don't mind the ring. It's just for fashion. I literally keep ring. This hand is bigger than this hand. Let me just explain it. My right side is bigger than my left. So sometimes I might put a ring on this finger and it actually gets stuck. I had to get this cut off in February. This is the ring I was originally supposed to wear to the concert. So that's why everyone saw me with it on that night. But I always wear a ring. It be for reasons. Uh, going out a bunch of harassment and you could just say i'm married you see what i'm saying so sometimes i just keep it on for 
personal reasons. So, anything that I did not ask that you want to say to the people? Um, I would just say thank you, thank you, the Bahamas, because. I have been, like I say, trying for years, reaching out to people for help, assistance, and I couldn't get it. So I see this right now as my breakthrough, and I'm gonna ride. I'm gonna ride it as long as I could, because him being one of my favorite artists. I can't say nothing different. <laughs>